Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a new six and a half acre home site with electricity and road frontage near public land in New Mexico. This is the parcel outlined here in green, and you can see you have about 475 feet of road frontage along Mustang Road that runs along the entire north boundary of the property. And then you also have electricity lines and poles already in place along the southern portion of the property. This is an aerial view north of the property looking to the south and you can see this is the road frontage along Mustang Road there. This is where the approximate eastern boundary of the property is, approximate western boundary. You can see some younger trees growing on the property and then here are the electricity lines and poles along the southern portion. The property has great drive up access and is in close proximity to Indian Service Route 120 right here and then also the Candy Kitchen Trading Post and the Wild Spirit Wolf Sanctuary. So this distance from the property to this intersection right here where Indian Service Route 120 is along with the Candy Kitchen Trading Post and Wild Spirit Wolf Sanctuary. This is only about 1.1 miles from the property. So the Candy Kitchen Trading Post has food, lumber, supplies, groceries, and then here's the Wild Spirit Wolf Sanctuary which is a popular destination. This is the intersection of Indian Service Route 120 and Five Gate Road that takes you to the property. And then here's where Five Gate Road and Mustang Road intersect. And then Mustang Road is the road that runs along the entire north boundary. So then here we are looking down Mustang Road to the property. You can see there's also electricity lines and poles running along Mustang Road, along with underground telephone and internet lines. And then here we are on Mustang Road as we near the property. So then here we are on Mustang Road looking south into the property. So these are Google Earth terrain views. This is north of the property looking south. Now we're east of the property looking west. You can see here are some of the nearby landowners that have built on their properties. Now we're south of the property looking north, and now we're west of the property looking east. This is the topographic map which indicates a path of seasonal water flow that just intersects the southeast corner right there. So the property has an elevation between roughly 7,320 feet to 7,340 feet with a gentle slope from the southwest to the northeast. And then you're in close proximity to public land. You're about three quarters of a mile to this BLM land there which is about 305 acres. And then you're also just a little over a mile to uh, almost 15,000 acres of public land to the west of the property. And that public land includes both state land and BLM land. The state being shaded blue and then the BLM shaded yellow. So the property is in close proximity to hundreds of thousands of acres of public land. This includes the yellow shaded area which is BLM land, the purple which is national parks, then you have the green which is national forest, and this is all the Cibola National Forest. And then Highway 53 takes you right to that national forest. The blue is state land and then the orange is Indian reservations. The property is located in New Mexico's game management unit number 12. And then you're also just a short distance to game units 10, 11, and 13. And then these are some additional recent photos of the property just taken a few days ago. From the property, you have great views of the nearby rolling hills and public land. There's light tree coverage on the property with trees of varying species and sizes. Here's some native vegetation and grasses on the property. And here we are looking to the east along Mustang Road. And several of the nearby landowners have developed their properties with homes of varying sizes and types of construction. You can see a few neighbors right here. This is a great photo showing the you know, beautiful views of the big skies and the nearby hills. And the surrounding area has a you know, diverse terrain with many geological rock formations. In this image here, what we've done is circled where the nearby landowners have developed their properties. So you can see that dozens of landowners have found it feasible to build on their properties. And then you have a lot of flexibility with what you can do. Here's a nearby landowner that uh, you know, built a dome home on their property. And these are satellite images of what you know some of those nearby properties look like. You can see that they'll have some like a single wide mobile home. We saw the dome home. There's people that will have multiple accessory buildings. Looks like this landowner here maybe has a yurt. Looks like this landowner has, you know, corrals and, and barns. So you can have horses, livestock, other types of animals, exotics, etc. This area also has a popular cave system, which we've provided a map of here. And from the property, you're just a short drive to Grants, New Mexico, which is just a little over an hour from the property. Grants has a population of around 10,000. Then you're about just uh, about an hour and 15 minutes away from Gallup, New Mexico. And Gallup has a population population close to 22,000. And then you're just about two hours and 15 minutes from Albuquerque. And Albuquerque being the largest city in New Mexico, there's an international airport there, population well over half a million. And there's this little town called Pine Hill, which is about 10 miles from the property. And in Pine Hill, there's a gas station, there's a market, there's a post office, a credit union, there's a school there. You're also just about 25 minutes to the El Moro National Monument. This is the El Moro National Monument. And you can see the beautiful rock formations there. You're about 30 minutes to 
Rama, New Mexico. In Rama, there's an elementary school, a post office, cafe, family dollar. And then in Grants, which again is about an hour and 10 minutes from the property, there's a Walmart super center in Grants. And then this is the Cibola General Hospital in Grants. So we have the six and a half acre property price at just $10,000. All the property details are listed here on our website. As you can see from the photos, many of the nearby landowners have built on their properties. And then what we did is we searched the New Mexico office of the state engineer's website. They have a well permit search tool. And we found that many of the nearby landowners have wells where they hit water around 300 feet. So there were eight well logs that showed up in just this section where the property is located. And you can view those well logs by clicking this PDF right here. The property taxes are only $85.36 a year. There's no HOA. There's no HOA fees. There's no time limit to build. And here we have information on the distances to nearby cities and points of interest, along with links where you can find additional information about those locations. And we have all the GPS coordinates, over 70 photos, and this interactive map. So if this property fits what you're looking for, please go to our website and click on this Buy Now button. What that'll do is add a deposit of $499 to your cart, then click Checkout. Once you click Checkout, this window will appear where you can enter in all your information, then continue through the checkout process. Once the checkout process has been completed, we'll receive an instant notification that your $499 deposit has been made. We'll then take the property off the market, send you over a simple one-page purchase agreement, and arrange for the balance of payment. The remaining balance may be paid by wire transfer, cashier's check, bank draft, credit card, debit card, or any combination of those methods. The $499 deposit is credited towards the purchase, and we cover all of the closing costs. We make the whole process super simple, and it can be completed in as little as a day. If you have any questions, our phone number is on the top of every page of our website. That number is 713-597-7670. That number also receives text messages. We have this live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time. We try to be available as often as possible. If we're not available for whatever reason, please send us a message and we'll respond to you at our next availability. You can also fill out this contact form on our website or send us an email directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. And as always, we really appreciate you taking the time to watch our videos, view our properties, and share our website and all of our listings with your family, friends, and colleagues. May God continue to bless you and your family.